Hey, what's up, guys? Um, Opti here. I'm going to redo my teleporting tutorial for Source SDK because, according to one viewer, it was not good enough. Um, anyway, so I'm going to go into a little bit more depth. I'm not going to cuss as much. I'm not going to, you know, do all that other stuff. So, uh, the point of having a teleport is to get you from point A to point B. Point A is this doorway, point B is this doorway, and um, you can reverse it so you can get from point B to point A. You know, it doesn't matter. So, make sure you have uh, your map full of your allies and axes, and this is what you're going to want to do to create the, the teleport itself. Go to your browse, and or your browse textures, type in trigger, double click the trigger texture, now go to your doorway and just put a very small uh, strip wherever you want. I mean you can make it like a box or a sphere or whatever. I just make it a little itty bitty. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, so you go there, you put your trigger texture there. Now you click your trigger texture, you hold control and T and it brings you to this menu. Once you have the class, you just type in teleport, and it should be trigger underscore teleport. Um, for name, I'm just going to name it Billy. It doesn't need a name, but it is a lot more helpful. For remote destination will be teleport1. It'll show up red because you actually haven't created it yet. Okay, anyway, so go to um, flags, the flags tab, and check clients, check NPCs, check pushables, and check physics objects. That just means clients is you, NPCs are non-player controlled characters, um, pushables are grenades, and physics objects are um, physics objects that you guys have in your maps that you guys maybe want to put into this little teleport. Um, I'm going to copy it, so control C, and I'm going to paste it in the other doorway as well because I want um, a two-way teleport system. So once I have it in there, I'm just going to go there. I'm going to rename it Marcus. And then uh, for the, the destination, I'll just say Teleport 2. Okay. So now you guys have that down. Now all I have to do is create where you come out of. So for over here, uh, just put an entity in the level wherever you want your uh, person to come out of. Double click the entity and type in Teleport. And it should say info underscore teleport underscore destination. This one's name is teleport1. Hit apply. There are no flags for this at all. Um, so just copy him and then paste him over here. Flip him around a little bit. And there. Alright, go over there. Double click him. His name will be teleport2. And this is where you'll come out of if you go into this teleport over here. So, once you have that, you have your teleport system done. Um, usually a lot of teleports are just really bland looking. So I'm going to help you fix that up a little bit too, since I'm already on this giant ramble of how long my... You know, whatever. Okay, so go, go here, go to your browse thing, and type in laser or beam or wire or whatever you want and this will make it look a little better so just go to each doorway doorway why am I saying doorway so weird anyway go to each doorway and um, just make a texture there it'll look like this it, it moves in game so it'll look kinda cool kind of ominous kind of you know blah 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 um, it'll just make it look really awesome instead of the the regular crappy uh, teleport systems that I've seen where it's just a uh, big doorway or something and just maybe a light coming out of it anyway I'm sorry for all the rambling but that's how you create your teleport systems make sure that um, the flags are checked or else it really will not work that's the main problem that everyone has I mean they have the, the entities down they have the the textures down but they don't have the flags so once you have the flags down, it's pretty much all all your game from there. Um, this has been Opti with a longer than usual tutorial on something that really isn't that difficult. Anyway, if you guys liked the tutorial, go over here and comment, rate, and subscribe, and comment down there. Y you guys know what to do. Anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed that tutorial, listening to my smooth, sexy, sultry voice. 
and uh, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. So, see you later, guys. Have fun. Have a good day. Bye. So for those of you that didn't really quite understand the video, I put um, the download for the VMT, the VMH, the whatever it is, uh, in the sidebar. So if you just check the description, there will be a download link there so you can check it out yourself instead of listening to my voice. <laughs>